Callie from Beast Robotics and today we'll be doing the walking water experiment. For this experiment you will need seven clear plastic cups, six sheets of paper towel, red, yellow, and blue food coloring, and some water. The first step is to take four of the cups, line them up, and fill them most of the way with water. you're going to put food coloring into the cups. You're going to do about five drops in each. The first cup is red. Then yellow. Then blue. And then finally, red again. Then you're going to put the three empty cups in between the ones full of water and leave them empty. Next, you're going to fold the six paper towels. Here's how you fold the paper towels. You fold it in half, and then in half again, and then in half the other direction. Make sure to press down so it stays folded. You're then going to do that with the other five paper towels. between the cups with one end in a cup of water and one end in an empty cup. Next, write down your hypothesis. What do you think is going to happen? my experiment overnight and look at the awesome results. Why does this happen? This happens due to something called capillary action. Water exhibits what is called a capillary rise, which means it can travel up small tubes. This is because water has strong adhesive forces, so it sticks to other materials more than it sticks to itself. The fibers in the paper towel create the small tubes for the water to travel up. That's why paper towel can absorb so much water. Capillary action is how plants get water too. Small tubes in the plant roots and plant stems pull water up from the ground to the leaves. Thanks for watching. Be sure to tag us on social media with the hashtag BeastStemCamp and check in next time for another awesome experiment. <laughs>